Hey, what's up YouTube? Did you miss me? It's your girl Atlas. And um today is I don't really know what today's date is, so it's fine. Whatever. Um, I just wanted to come through really quickly. Well, y'all know me. My videos are never quick, so I'll just say I'll try to keep this within one video. Um, first thing I wanted to speak on, and I'm gonna try to speak on it quickly and move past it. Um, I know I've been MIA and I've been in my ear for a reason. Um, if you all saw the last video that I did, I wasn't even in it, but last video I did um, was concerning my grandmother. Unfortunately, but fortunate enough for God and the angels, um, she did not make it. She passed away. So, so excuse me if this video is going to be chopped up and all of that stuff because I'm dealing. But I didn't want to keep... Um, continuing to neglect you all so I just wanted to come through really quickly so that's why we're going to speak on this and we're going to keep it pushing feel me um but yeah um what I really wanted to do was just say thank you to all of those who follow me on twitter and they were reading my tweets those days leading up to you know um I appreciate you all those who offered their kind and encouraging words um I like to thank those who actually subscribed to my videos while I was gone. And before I go any further, quite frankly, I'm not completely back because I just, you know, so I'm not completely back. Um, so I'm still gonna be a little bit, a little bit MIA. Um, I'm gonna try to get back into doing my videos on a more regular basis. But just to be quite frank with you, they're gonna be um, sporadic right now. So, you know, my bad. Not really, but, you know. I'm trying to think. I had everything planned that I wanted to say, and then I turned the camera on, and I got distracted or whatever. But, um, yeah, I just want to really thank you all. Um, I'm not going to specifically name anyone because I don't want to leave anyone out. So, you know, if you hit me up, if you were um, tweeting me or you read my tweets or you left comments you sent me messages whatever the case may be you know who you are so thank you and I really appreciate it um one thing I really wanted to say well two things I want to say and then I'm gonna move on past that I think it was stuff I wanted other stuff I wanted to like put out there but I just can't remember right now all right so um what I will say is number one and this is not to be on no ignorant type stuff or anything like that. It's just I've come to the realization that it does not help. So this is for the people who think that it helps. I appreciate you. I'll tell you in advance. This way you don't even have to waste your breath. But um, if I tell you about my loss, I'd rather for you to just say I'm sorry about your loss. And thank head bounce. Keep it moving. You know what I mean? I'd just rather you tell me that. Keep it moving rather than... Um, Telling me, hey, I'm sorry for your loss, but, um, you know, you had a long time with her. Uh, she lived a good life. Um, well, you knew she was sick for a while. You, shit like that. It does not help. <clears throat> Excuse me. It does not help. So just say, I'm sorry for your loss. And bang it on out, all right? Um, second thing, um, people ask me, you know, is there anything that I can do for you? Um, do you need anything? Um... So this is what I've, I've come to in my mind. This is what I would like you all to do for me. Have you ever seen the movie Pay It Forward? You know, it's, um, what's that little boy's name? Haley Joe Osmond. Joel Osmond. Whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Little Six Cents boy. Um, he comes up with this idea. He does something for two people. They do something for two people, so on and so forth. Yeah. I'm, I'm not doing a Pay It Forward type thing, but what I, what I will say is, my Nana told me a few days before she passed. Actually, she told Lavender and myself because, of course, you know, that's my fiancé. So she's been completely and totally by my side. Um, she told us both, if it is something that you want to do, do it. Do not wait. Okay? So I say that to you all. That's what you can do for me. Don't try to give me a card with money in it. Don't try to... Make me nothing to eat now if you want to do it. I ain't going to stop you. But I'm just saying, you know, don't do that for me. What you can do for me is 
do what it is you really want to do. I don't care how big, how small. I don't care if you always wanted a specific type of gum and you never got it. Do it. Because nothing ever, ever, ever is guaranteed, okay? Um, it's really not, like five minutes from now is not really guaranteed. So, if there's anything you want to do, do it because that's what I'm trying to do. That's 2010, it's not a game because this is a hell of a way to start your year. So, that's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm doing what I want to do, no matter how big or how small. And, you know, things certain things are just going to take time. Y'all know, I want to go to Tokyo. I can't afford that right now. But, one day I will get there and I'm going to do the small things that I know I can do. The things that are attainable. And if I am fortunate enough to live a long life, then I'm going to do it. You feel me? So, that's what you all can do for me. If it's something you want to do, do not wait. Do it want to thank you all and this weekend is going to be especially hard actually Sunday in particular it is going to be especially hard because it will be the first time um, my whole family will be back at the church where her service was and it's also her birthday I was going to say it was it, it would have been but no it's her birthday um she would have, I'll say that she would have been 79 so clearly she was not an old lady alright so we're going to go to church together as a family, and we're going to celebrate her birthday because that's something she also told me a few days prior that she said, my birthday's coming up, and see, y'all heard that. It might be some chopping and pasting, copy and pasting stuff. <laughs> um, <clears throat> she told me, she said, my birthday's coming up, and I was like, yeah, I know. And she was like, well, we're going to have a celebration for my birthday. So, I made sure I passed on the message to the rest of my family, kind of soul food style, except it's not a lie. Um, and I passed that on, so we're going to have, like, a celebration for her birthday on her birthday. Now, I'm hoping I'm keeping this in the 10 minutes. Actually, let me check. Okay, so, now, moving on to less important things. Um, what can I tell you? I'm just going to tell you all some random shit. Y'all like my glasses? Miss P, come on, son. But I really like these, so they rip, they rip frames, and, um, they're, like, kind of, um, clear, translucent. Is that the right word? I don't know. They're like my hat. For some reason, I always wanted one of these hats. I don't know, whatever. Um, I have a hat on in the house, yes, because, um, um, my hair, my, it still looks kind of freshly cut, but when I take this off, girl, no. That's my new thing for 2010 as well. It's called, shut it down in 2010. Just take your hand like that. Just, you got to change things in this year, alright? Um, what else can I tell you? I got a new phone, y'all. You see it? Oh, well, let me turn it on. Uh, okay, I'm in the middle of a text message. Y'all can't see all that. But, y'all see this? It's called the Samsung Moment. It's touchscreen. I never had a touchscreen phone before, y'all. So, like, it takes some getting used to. See, I can't even move the screen. Look. There's Lavender. Hey, she's checking in. <laughs> but, um, here's the touchscreen. It has a little slide out keyboard I figure hey I can get my full upgrade less upgrade so got a new phone um, what else can I tell you it's not really much um we do actually have lavender and myself which reminds me let me put this in there those who um have subscribed to two olive juice with love thank you so very much I really appreciate it and those who haven't um It'll be down at the bottom, so y'all need to hook that up and subscribe. We do have videos coming. I have videos coming on my channel. I don't know when. I'm not even going to, like, lie to you. Um, I have a lot of things filmed. We have a lot of things filmed, but it's just, right now, it's a trying time. So, I haven't had the time to edit anything. So, there will be a lot of videos coming, though, when they are, you know, going to come. I think that's about it. I'm about to get on up out of here. You're going to dig me. Um... I do want to again say thank you so very much to everyone who has been around, who has been present, um, excuse me, who have been present, and um, <clears throat> thank you all to those who have subscribed and I haven't even posted anything, like I've been MIA, like, thank you. <laughs> thank you for commenting on, like, old behind videos. I do thank you. I really, really do appreciate each and every, each and every one of you. And um, I'm just going to leave you all with this. Again, if it is something that you want to do, do not wait. Do it. All right? On that note, I am Atlas, and this is Don't Be Afraid to Think TV, and I'm out.